Hey YouTube, what's up? It's Gizzy and welcome back to more Final Fantasy 7 Blind Part 30. So we left off, we got sent to Desert Prison. Or helping Barrett. This one's been shot. I think we ended off with that. Now we're gonna go this way. Hopefully no one attacks us. Damn dirty bandits. Was oh, that the guy? Let's see. Yeah, okay, if we would've went that way, we would've gone to that cliff and not been able to move here. Oh, God damn it. Dun, dun, dun. What the hell are these things? Matra magic? Attack with the quick button. Learn enemy skill. Matra magic. Does that mean I can shoot missiles? Jesus Christ. Bull motor A. Matra magic. Not everyone has their limit break. Aw, oh, damn it. Ah, oh, I missed that last one. Blade beam. Somersault. Water kick. Mind blow. Reduce a bone opponent's and Oh, that's what that does. Alright, I'm gonna use my limits to finish everyone off. Oh, he's pissed. How dare you come at me! Bam! That was pretty cool. That was a nice way to finish that fight. Everyone just using their freaking, uh, limits. Oh, Tifa, so close. We got an ether. Not bad. Oh, there's one thing I wanted to do. I should have done it off screen, but, uh, I still... I take a break from this game and it it messes my how do I do this again no I, yeah there we go that's what I wanted to do I wanted to put him in the back uh, let's see man the boss was really in a bad mood today or was it one of the better days what oh, okay I can keep going to the right what the hell now all of a sudden there's just a junkyard where the hell am I? Uh, let's go up here? I have no idea where I'm going. Oh, look, cutscene started. I hear something. Oh, wow, we found him. Dean, is that you? Now that's a voice I haven't heard in years. A voice I'll never forget. I always hoped you'd be able to I would be able to see you again. Why the hell am I so much trouble reading this text? I knew you were alive somewhere. We had the same operation. Listen to me, Dean. No, he just shot at his feet. What's that? I hear her voice. Huh? I hear her voice, Eleanor's voice, begging me not to hate your rotten guts. That's why I didn't hunt you down. I know I was stupid. I'm not asking you to forgive me. What are you doing in a place like this? Why you want to kill those that ain't even involved? Why? The hell do you care? Are the people killed going to understand why are the people of coral going to understand just hearing shinra's excuses i don't care what the reason is all they give us are artillery and stupid excuses what's left is a word of despair and emptiness a world i said word god damn it. who the fuck is calling me you still want to hear why all right i'll tell you because I want to destroy everything. The people of the city. The city itself. The whole world! I got nothing left in this world. Coral, Eleanor, Marlene. Marlene, still alive. Hmm? I went back into town. I thought she was gone, for sure. That is why I wanted to be by her side till the end. 
That's when I found her. Found Marlene. She's in Midgar. Let's go see her together, alright? So, she's still alive. Alright, Barrett. I guess that means you and I gotta fight. What? Eleanor's alone all by herself. I've gotta take Marlene to her. Are you insane? Marlene wants to see her mom, don't she? I can't die yet! Well, my life's been over ever since then. I don't want to fight you! You stay the hell out of it. This is my problem. <laughs> that was pretty emotional. So now it's Dean. Wow, he looks a lot buffer now. Needle gun. Let's see how much mine does. 109. So I'm stronger. I'm also in the back, so that helps. <laughs> what magic did I give him? Poisona. Restores life. Incures a small state. Induces or cures a small state. Oh, let's just attack him. Just a gunfight between two men with gun arms. Douche. So I'm obviously going to win at this rate. It's kind of boring. And my limit is getting there. It's time to die, Dean. This probably isn't going to kill him, though. Did a shitload of damage, though. And he missed. Does he also have a limit? Oh my god, I think he does. It didn't do nearly as much damage as I thought it would do, though. Did I... Something happen? Attack him! Yeah, all those... Oh god, he's doing S-mine again. And he missed. Wow. How much health do you have, man? So, do I have a magic that heals me? What the hell? And he missed again. Oh my god, the thing. Oh, he summons a little fairy that heals me. And it missed! It fucking missed! <laughs> Molotov cocktail? I might actually die now. If I miss with this, if I miss with this thing again, I'm gonna die. Okay, I'm an idiot. <laughs> um, I'm so used to every game just life being life and not them being separate things. <laughs> so apparently the life thing just when people die it, it heals them it picks them up and for some reason I thought it would also heal my life that's just me that was my stupid mistake um, and it looks like I don't have that enemy skill anymore how dare you use s mine on me you get shot in the face I'm gonna kill you this time Dean because I have the right trump card now. That's right, you miss. Now, I can't see how much health he has because I don't have sense. Wait, I might actually have it. I just dumped a, a stupid amount of things on on him. Which I actually probably shouldn't have done that. Oh, I should have probably taken away his uh, MP. And now there's no point. Okay, let me see what magic I have. Secure life, sleeple, mini. What is going on? Oh my god, I put restore on him. This is restore his HP. Cure. Did I do this right? 
Okay, I must have. Yeah, I must have switched. Okay, I'm just. I'm confused myself. <laughs> I'm scared myself and confused myself at the same time. Why is this a Molotov cocktail? It's just like sprouting like lasers at me. Good shot. I already have my limit back. I wonder if I could win just by healing myself and then keep using, uh, like my limit. Damn. Uh, I'm not attacking here. It took forever. Let me do that on him. Take away his MP. Zero MP. But he's probably using just like thrown items more than he's actually using MP. Yeah, like all his attacks are like thrown things, I think. Wow, I must have been fucking super close to winning last time. If I would have kept attacking instead of wasting two turns trying to heal myself, I probably would have won. Damn, I'm an idiot. I got a silver armlet, though. That's actually pretty good, isn't it? I might put that on cloud. Ugh. Back. You lean against the wall. It wasn't just my arm back then. I left something irreplaceable. I don't know where. I went wrong. I don't know either, man. Is this the only way we can resolve this? I told you. I want to destroy everything. Everything this crazy world, even me. And what about Marlene? What's going to happen to her? Think about it, Barrett. How old was Marlene back then? Even if I did go to her now, she wouldn't even know me. And what's more, Barrett? These hands are a little too stained to carry Marlene anymore. Barrett. Give that pendant to Marlene. It was Eleanor's. My wife's memento. All right. Already four. Don't make, don't make Marlene cry. Dean. 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 Damn. He drops to his knees. Me and you were the same. My hands ain't any cleaner. I should be able to shouldn't be able to carry Marlene either. Ah That was pretty emotional. I wonder if each character is gonna have a little thing like that. That would be cool. Like Mass Effect 2, like each character has their own thing. You want something? I want to go up. Like I told you before, you gotta get the boss permission when you win the chocobo. Then win the Dean's got his reasons and can't speak. So I got this instead. Oh, Dean was the boss? Yeah, bull. I want to go up. But right. Did you kill Dean? You must have, and you'd never be holding that thing. So Dean's dead. Maybe now the place will calm down a little. Didn't care who anyone was. The hell do you know? R -r right, I mean, no, I, I don't know anything. So, sorry. Then will you get us out of here? Huh? Oh man, you guys are mistaken. I already told you, there's only one way to get out of here. That's to win the chocobo race. That's held up there, in the gold saucer. And the only racer can go up at one at a time. Say what? No, really, even if you threaten me. A rule's a rule, I can't change it. If I do, the whole system down here will get messed up, and I can't do that. I'll let one go up there, after that he's gotta deal with Dio. Alright then. 
Cloud, you go. We'll wait down here. Hurry up with that chocobo race and get us out of here. I wonder what the chocobo race is going to be like. We'll be waiting and rooting for you. Eh, oh well. Have you decided? All you need now is a manager. And register and get a chocobo. Ha. Huh. I happen to hear your story. Esther? What the hell? Who's this? I'll be your manager. Well, I have nothing against it, but... This is Esther. She may look kind of funny, but there's no better manager in the races. That's so rude. Nice to meet you, Cloud. Alright then, Cloud. I'll send you up there at the elevator. Esther will find you. Fill you in on the details. God, mother damn. I thought she was going to find us a chocobo. Hmm, so that's what happened. I'll talk to Dio directly. You just concentrate on the race. Getting back to the other thing, there are many different types of chocobo jockeys. It's not only for criminals. Some people compete for the fame. Some people compete for the money. Some only for glory. And then there's people like you. I'll teach you how to ride a chocobo. Alright. Um, first, use the select button to choose either auto or manual. In other words, either you control the chocobo or let it run on its own. But it's pretty hard to make the chocobo run the way you want it to if the chocobo doesn't like you. It won't listen. You can't really help it help on this one. But most of the chocobos that I'll provide you with are mellow and you should be able to handle them. When you're riding, use square button to speed up, X button to slow down. If you go faster than the chocobo can handle, it'll lose its stamina really fast. And use the directional buttons to move the chocobo left and right. Use circle button to get a boost of speed. What are you, like, fucking slap it on the ass or something? Of course, your stamina runs out faster, though. Okay, so it's a stamina bar race. There are some bad-tempered chocobos that can pace themselves, can't pace themselves, and they'll lose their stamina pretty fast. For those kinds of chocobos, you should set the controls on manual and slow it down. Finally, some advice for the restless ones. For the restless. Once the first and second chocobo cross the goal line, push the start button to end the race. Okay. So we're up here with all the jockeys now. <laughs> they just looked at us and they just go back to their card game. You knew? Hi, Joe. Hey, Esther, you're looking pretty as usual. Thanks. Let me introduce you, Clown. This is Joe, one of the top Chocobo road jockeys. What the fuck? I was about to say Rody. Nice to meet you, Clown. Uh, if you're with Esther, then... Right, he's an up-and-coming jockey. He's only been down here for a day and already made it up here. What? Oh, I see. So, what did you do down there? Sorry, you're not supposed to ask about the past here. Pretty interesting. I have a feeling that we'll meet again. And until we meet again, Cloud. Like the same line of dialogue twice. We're going to check on the chocobo. You just wait here for a while. Okay, and what is this? Just little stables or something? I got nothing to say. Nothing. Don't get cocky. Skills don't matter once you get in the race. Wait, what? The race will start in a few moments. Will the jockeys for the next race please proceed to the road pad? Paddock? It's a paddock. Eh, what is this thing right here? Rama material. I mean, notice that thing. Ruma? What the fuck was that? There's a computer. <laughs> uh, well, let's go down here then. Looks like I have to be the last, or... No, I think I have to wait for that woman. Yep. Oh, now I've got to talk to her. Thanks for waiting. I registered you in the next race. This is the chocobo I prepared myself. He won't lose easily. Oh yeah, you know how to ride one? Uh, how is it again? I got it. Then let's... Then good luck. Now, do I want manual... Or auto. 
I cannot see what I'm doing. Where am I? Ah! Where's my stamina? There it is. Ah! It's like fucking Rainbow Road! How do I- how do I restore my manual? Oh my god, I'm losing. Go faster! Do I have to keep hitting X? I think so. Oh god, they spun me out. Ah! Bastards! Oh my god, how are those guys so far ahead? Stupid blue chocobo, get out of my way! You motherfuckers. How do I- can you build your stamina or it just runs out and you'll be done? Okay, I'm not exactly sure how this works. Can I collect these? I want- oh my god. What is going on? This is totally Rainbow Road, man. I can't see which way do I go. I think I'm in first. Not anymore. My stamina is almost done. What the hell? I came in third? I think? Yeah, I think I came in third. God damn it. Do I have to do it again? Ah, I really wish I wished. I won. Too bad. I was expecting a little more for you. Oh, shut up! I didn't understand how this shit works at all. Let me find a better chocobo for you. Wait here a while, okay? God damn it. <laughs> Race starts soon in a few minutes, Jackie's. <laughs> I repeat. Hmm. I guess I just didn't do it well enough. Talk to me, damn it. I mean, I kept pressing square to speed up. Like, I couldn't tell if I was going max speed. At one point, I was like, stopped. Hmm. This is just something I gotta get used to. Hello. Thanks for waiting. I registered in the next race. This is a trick by purpose. I won't lose easily. You know how to ride one? Let me just double check here. Auto manual. It's pretty simple. Make the trick ball run the way you want it to. The trick ball doesn't like you. It won't listen. How do I know if it likes me or not? I guess as you can't really know. Square button to speed up. X to slow down. Loose stamina. Okay. Get boost the speed. Uh, bad temper trick bows. Uh, control manual. Do do do. Star button and the race. Okay then. Yeah, I, I thought I was doing that. Oh well, let's give it a go and then. Dan did it in. Let's go. Wait, I'm gonna do it manual this whole time because I feel like that's. I think they kind of screwed me over. Stop losing stamina, damn it. Uh, stay on the in course. I feel like I'm doing much better right now. Uh, let's go, Mr. Chocobo. Me and you were best buds. I'm down to half stamina. My god, the camera. Come on, man. Be my friend, don't be my enemy. Speed up a little. Go back down. This is much better with manual controls. I feel like I'm actually doing something. Then we're going through... The hell are we going through right now? We're in this weird fucking dimension now. <laughs> see, where are we on the map? Oh, Jesus. Is this the end of the race? I like the victory music. Oh my god. I like we're just hopping on the chocobo. Okay, let's end this sucker. So that's all I had to do, right? Congratulations, now you're home free. Oh yeah, the owner told me to give you this letter to you when you won. Boy, if you're reading this letter, then you must have won, and won a victory that I am sure you earned. I heard about Dean from Esther. Now that you are victorious, I promise you that you and all your friends will get a full pardon. 
and you will all be set free. And also, by the way of apology, I prepared a little gift for you to use on your journey. Sorry I couldn't be there to tell you this in person, but I'm a very busy man. Dio. A gift? A cell phone? Cloud, isn't this great? The assistant manager stopped by and dropped off a buggy for you. Now you can go over deserts and rivers, no problem. I'll be waiting outside. Oh my god, he gave us a car? The letter continues. I just recently met Sephiroth. He must have a lot of fans with boys your age. What? Why don't you get his autograph? It seems he's headed towards the south of the river, towards Gongaga. Sephiroth. I guess this is goodbye. Well, if you ever get your own race, Chocobo, come back again. I'll take care of your registration and everything. I'll see you again. How do I get a race, Chocobo? I want a race, Chocobo. I want to race. Uh, I feel like I want to... I want Yuffie for now. And then how do I... Uh, hmm. So where am I going to start now? Itchy back. Itchy, itchy, itchy. Oh my god, I'm in a buggy. How to drive the buggy. Press the OK button to get on. Press the cancel button to get off. Buggies can cross shallow rivers and deserts. You can even enter Costa del Sol and Junon by buggy by hitching a ride on the cargo ship. How does it... How does it go? So I'm turning... Oh, okay, it's D-pad. And I accidentally went straight back here. <laughs> Why am I in the desert? I want to go back into the casino. Am I going to have to spend 3000 thing again because I'm... Um, because I left, I guess? Oh my god, I hate how this looks. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to end this episode off here. It's been a weird episode. Okay, this has been Kiss Dan. Thanks for watching. Tune in next time where I go to Gungaga or something. I don't know. I think it's where I'm pointing to right now, but I don't know. <laughs> Peace. Mother loving out.